What's up, everyone? I'm Timothy Amayam Jr. This is my Um, I haven't done one of these in a while. Alcohol review. Well, I'm doing a, a two towns today called T Rex from the thumbnail. Tea time with a bite. Original black tea and honey, 8% volume. Alcohol by volume, 12 six ounce cans. This was $17.95 plus 60 cents deposit. <clears throat> 10 cents per can. Um, yeah, so it's just a cute little uh, play on words here. T-Rex playing croquet. Yeah. In his fancy thing, fancy dress with his fancy monocle. Well, let's get into it and see what we uh, got here. See if it's worth the uh, eighteen dollar price tag. And like always, they have their uh, generic. Um, I call it generic. I guess they're more uh, cheaper. Instead of printing on the can, they just slap a sticker on it. It's probably covering up and another label. I guess it's just way cheaper to do it this way um, Mom? it's pretty cool they got the little like uh, was this uh, London can't remember what that's called I want to say it's in London let's see Unearth a new era of tea with T-Rex, a bigger and bolder take on classic. Refined yet crushable, the monst mon monstrously delicious flavor of T-Rex is classy enough for pinkies out. With ample bite to make sure tea time never goes extinct. Original is crafted with rich black tea and local honey for a crushable tea that's easy drinking and dangerously good. Join the uproar at Drink T-Rex. Hard cider tax class. So on the can we get a little bit more in depth, he's knocking the thing of tea over. Party foul right there. Um, T Rex and her damn tails. So it has a very strong cider scent to it. You can smell the apple. It just smells like a cider. I'm not too sure that this um, cider infused with black tea really works. I'm not tasting a whole lot of like honey at all. Excuse me. So I don't think the cider infused with the tea and the honey really work very well. I don't really taste any honey little bit of the black tea but mostly I just get a cider flavor to it yeah it comes comes on kind of strong with the cider and then you get the tea filtered in there and it's really hard to taste the notes of honey with the cider flavor it kind of overpowers it but it's not it's not bad while at the same time, it's not worth the $18, like, at all. Um, I'm just, I just don't understand how these uh, companies 
know how to charge and because they're not advertising very well either because this does not taste as advertised nor does it taste eighteen dollars worth so i mean like did the uh person who make this taste it and go oh my god it's so good eighteen dollars worth no it's because it's not it's definitely not um anyways you guys are here for the score i don't recommend you try it and if you have tried it, let me know what your thoughts are on it um but i don't recommend buying it and wasting your money um there's plenty of other hard teas out there that are 10 times better um yeah it's like a six out of ten that's your review. I'm Timothy Elmine Jr. And until next time, fuck off.